-huh. You cannot be recording. This is a health facility, uh -huh. so you cannot be recording. But if you're just going to be recording inside, you need to go ahead and be elsewhere. Yeah, do you want me to go Google that and shut yeah, print something ahead. out I'll for be, you? I'll be out right here. Are you really, seriously, you want that? Yes, I do. Thank you. <laughs> you offered it. I'm just going to go with you because I just do feel that you are actually flying here. So I'm just going to hang out for a while. Excuse me? Can you turn that off? Do you work here? I do work here. Oh. Yeah. Can I see your name badge, please? Yes. The cars. Right. We're aware of this situation. Recording going I'm out and assaulting people. We are concerned because concerned about somebody it. got assaulted last week. Okay. Go. Good job, Karen. Make up excuses. Shout out Angry Vet Audits. Got you. Never like those guys. For the police. Yo, body cam off so my camera stays on. Crooked ass cops won't like this song. Gotta film the police when they do something wrong. I'ma film the police when they do something wrong. What's up, everyone? This is Angry Bad Audits, and I'm out here in Santa Cruz, California. I went there to check out the Santa Cruz County offices to see if they respect the people's rights to peacefully record in public. I ran into a few employees that didn't appreciate me recording. One of them even tried to follow me around until they realized they couldn't keep up. Mount up and get ready for the ride. Yeah, is there, where's the main entrance at? Uh, what is it that you're inquiring about? What's that? What is it that you're inquiring about? Oh, I'm just trying to check out the public office. The public office? Yeah. Okay, so you can um, go through 1060 and you can gain entrance, but you're not going to be able to gain entrance to the offices. Okay. So it's just the lobby. All right. Okay? So... Let's see here, no kids left in cards. Let's see if this door is open. Looks locked. It looks like she was out there looking for me through the window. Uh, she should probably just get back to work. Check to make sure all these doors are secure. The other side is 1060 if you're trying to gain entrance to the lobby. Uh -huh. You cannot be recording. This is a health facility, uh -huh. so you cannot be recording. Well, yeah, I'm in public right now. This is I get it. anybody so out here. Anybody could come here. All right. So if you need create services, your create your privacy, lower the blinds. Don't tell services. me what to do. I don't okay. need directives, if you right? Need services, you can tell us what you need, and we can try to help you. But if you're just going to be recording inside, you need to go ahead and be elsewhere. You cannot. Record I'm just recording what I could see from public space. All right. I understand, but what I don't There's no restriction is, right how here. How can we help you? You're just Recording. I don't I don't need your help. I'm just I'm okay. recording. Okay. Have you heard of the First Amendment? Yes, I have. Okay, okay. But again, we're just wondering what you're doing here and if you need assistance. I told you I'm assistance. just taking footage. That's all. Okay. Working on the story.
This must be 1060. It's not 1060. I thought she said 1060. That was a lobby. How's it going? You go? Talking to me? You help? No. no. Do you need help? No. I'm just, you know, just okay. So why don't you ask that guy if he needs help? Oh, he's on okay. <laughs> Is that your office up there? Where you came out of? I don't even have an office. Huh? I don't even have an office. Oh, okay. <laughs> just, uh, did someone up there complain or? What was it? Did someone up there complain or something? No, I'm just doing my rounds. And oh, I'm you're just doing your rounds? Oh, okay. What office is up there? I don't really know. I think it's just like a conference huh? room, I guess. Oh. Yeah, I'm just trying to find all the public lobbies basically right now. So. Oh, okay. Just oh. get, you'll probably see me if you're doing rounds and stuff. You'll probably see me walking around. Oh, I, well, at least not today. <laughs> I didn't see you today because I was kind of busy doing something else on my own building. Oh, okay. Uh, All right. Yeah. All right, then, man. Have a good day. All right, Take care. Day. Yeah. Hi, I'm uh, just uh, inspecting the lobby here.
Oh, not right now. Thank you. Okay. Well, um, I, you can. Sure. My name is Lonnie Garcia. Yeah. I'm the facilities liaison for this building. Thank you. So I just want to make sure that you have any help you need, if there's any directions you need, anything else you need here today. I'm also going to ask that you um, try to not catch the public in okay. your filming. Yeah, just I'm very mindful of that. I'm not going to do that. Thank you. That's all, that's all we ask. All right. We know you can be here. Uh -huh. I, I was just wondering, I was almost thinking that she was part of the public because I didn't see a name tag displayed on her. Is it your policy to display a name tag as you are? She, it is our policy to have uh -huh. name tags, but she's not a staff member. Oh. It's a different um, agency who's okay. allowed to use this desk sometimes. So, oh. so what agency would that be? Um, they're called MH Can. MH Can, and what yeah. do they do? There's um, stuff on the wall if you want to look them up. I don't no, really actually well, know very much about them. I just you offered them. help. <laughs> now I'm asking for yeah, yeah. information. I'm telling you that I actually don't know very much about them. So you're, what was your position? The liaison of what? For the pers for the building. I'm liaison actually a few different building. liaisons, so, but so you should be facilities. able to communicate with other people. Yeah, and you want me to go Google that and shut yeah, print something out I'll for be, you? I'll be out right here. Are you really seriously? You want that? Yes, I do. Thank you. You offered it. I do want to help. If that's important to you, I, I can do. look that up. Thank you. Because, you know, I think everybody should have a name tag if they're working on you, regardless if it's a private company that you guys are using or not. Is this your office? My office is back here. You can't come in. So okay. So she has a little bit of an attitude. Uh, she offered help. I asked for it. And she got an attitude when I asked for the help. So, you know, I'm not here to give anybody a hard time, but if you come up to me and you're offering help, assistance, or information that I may want, uh, don't get a crappy attitude after I ask for it. Go check out go and see if she's gonna print out that information for me. Take a quick little drink here. Oh, there she is. Alright, thank you. Do you happen to have a business card that I can get? Sure. For me. Yeah, for you, of course. Yeah, appreciate it. I'll, I'll look at this later, the information you gave me. Lanny Garcia. Departmental Administrative Analyst. So. Hi. You know, one thing I noticed down the hall, up there, down that hall, it looked like they were talking to a client in the hallway. 
Is that common practice here? Or do you guys usually try to create some privacy and give the clients privacy by letting them use like an office or a private room? Sometimes. Because anybody could just walk back there, you know, and they're, they have to expose their whole story. They may feel compelled to do it there if you don't offer a pri privacy, right? We have private rooms. Some people prefer to do that. And actually some people prefer to be outside. So we usually let that be client land on where they prefer. Do you, to do. is that part of your routine to ask? Um, if they would like a private setting or not? I'm sure it is for the people who are dealing with You're the sure? Clients. Do you know or are you guessing? I'm sure because I kind of know how this, that part of the situation acts. And the reason I'm here because is because you're not a client. That's why I'm dealing with you as opposed to the people. Who so let's say if I were to walk down this hall, I respected the client. I pointed my camera down. But if I were to just stand there, it would be perfectly all right for me to do so. Well, it looks like they already went inside, but, you know, in situations like that, it seems like you should you should offer every client, you know, the private setting. Yeah, I don't, sure I don't, offered, and I will just tell you, a lot of times the, the clients feel more comfortable out here, and sometimes they want to be outside, okay. so we do let them meet us where they feel most comfortable. Okay. That's part of what we really have to do here is meeting the client's needs. Right. To make them I mean, that's a good answer, but I, I don't know if I believe it 100%. Okay. I'm just going to go with you because I just do feel that you aren't actually a client here, so I'm just going to hang out for a while. You feel that what? You aren't a client here, and you're not here for that reason. What reason? To, to receive services yourself. Why, why would I need to be a client to no, you come don't up need here? To. No, no, not at all. So, so why would you need to come with me? I don't need to. I am just feel like that might okay, be Okay, well, best do, do what you need to do. And in the future, if you offer someone coming in here, you know, You're not my first. help or some sort of information. Then I will get them help. You would think that you would keep a good good attitude and not get all uh, attitude. sour attitude when they actually ask you for information. Now you do know if that's your personal phone or even a government issued phone, you're taking photos of me. I oh, can I didn't take a photo actually, I was just checking my messages. Okay. Just let me know. So we got a uh, brick hitter. Let's look at this business card. Lanny Garcia is going to give me a full escort around this building. I don't want any of my staff to be confused and think you can't record. I want to make sure they know I'm here with you and you can. So, I'm just gonna take a little break here. Sorry to walk here. <laughs> Do you think you have a longer break than I have email lists to Yeah, that's even
I'm all rested. You ready? Yeah. Right, let's go. I might have to use the bed. Next one. So as you can see guys, she just walked right by me. This lady's very helpful. Always asking if I need help. This one too. Doesn't look like many people come to this office. Some water there? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Gave you a little workout, huh? Um, better, no, better than looking at emails, huh? I didn't have yeah. a workout yet today. 
But let all the receptionists know, right? Yeah. Okay, yeah. there you go. Why, why are you making a big ruckus with all the staff? No, one, no one's given me a problem except you. And you'll see in the video, no one has approached me or bothered me at all, know, except for you. So and you're the one who's, you're, you're kind of rousing the rabble, so to speak. You're going around saying all this and that. Just, um, just let it be. It's been fine. organic. Everybody oh, has God. been, okay. nobody's yeah. been bothered. <laughs> I don't need you. Yeah, we're good. Yeah, you could do whatever you want. It was just a suggestion. Though. Thank you. So. Anyway, I'm glad that this one's very staffed. Do you want to stay all day? I mean, we could go find chairs again. I don't need to follow you. I just did want to make sure, at least on the first round, that your people knew you were allowed to be here. Mm, yeah, okay. Yeah. yeah. You're not, no. You're not a first one here. Okay. I watched them. Yeah, sure. Before. Yeah. Yeah. What is the handle you go by? On YouTube. I'm just curious, you know, watch the videos. Mm, uh -huh. Pardon? Nah. Uh -huh. Nah. -huh. Yeah, uh -huh. look it up. That? Look it up. <laughs> I don't know how to spell Naha. Yeah. Okay. I mean, honestly, I really don't care if you watch it or not. So. Uh, no, I know, you but know. you know, you said watch. So. But I'm sure you'll eventually watch yourself if it ends up being published. Um, Since not, you said you said you already watched them and you're some familiar. Some other people's probably not yours. Yeah. I, mean, well, I don't we'll think I've with you. I mean, I'm pretty sure I haven't. Huh. You follow the other people all around too? Um, yeah, you do pretty much the same thing. You do? It's not, you know. Yeah, I just want to make sure. Well, it didn't seem like you around. lasted too long following me around. I mean, you got winded pretty quickly. You had to stop for water, you know, for a little chit chat. It looked like you just gave up right there. So. Well, yeah, I'm not I'm too invested yeah. in this. Well, you seem yeah. pretty invested at the get go, but, you know. Is there anything else we can do to help you here? Because I don't know if you want any more. You know, we got some flyers we could give you if you're interested. Well, you know, last time I requested help, you had a little bit of an attitude. Your your, your demeanor turned sour. <laughs> you know, it's I'm just sad that it because... doesn't it doesn't make me want to ask for more help from you. You know, if I'm going to get that type of reaction and response. And if you do happen to see the video, you will see. You'll see what I'm talking about. You're, you are welcome to be here. I know I'm welcome. I don't need your welcoming, in fact. No, it's not it's my right to be here. I just want to let you know that okay. we know that you're allowed to be here. And that's really my main purpose here, to make sure that staff are not surprised by you being here. If they're not surprised, why do you feel the need to follow me everywhere? To make sure I'll they're not. For a little bit since see, you're contradicting in your words right now. Is there something so was else that, I can do to help you, sir? I already told you I don't need help, and I didn't need you to follow me around. So if you have work to do, I would get back to it. You already said you had a long list of emails you need to read through. I suggest you get on that. So people who need services aren't, aren't deprived of them because you want to stand around.
What's that? Uh, do you work here? Excuse me? Can you turn that off? Do you work here? I do work here. Oh. Yeah. Can I see your name badge, please? Yes. The other side with your name on it? No. I. All I saw was a rainbow. That's not a name badge. Yeah, what are, what are you doing here? Huh? Who are you? Who are you? I um, couldn't even see see your name tag. Why do you need my name tag? Because who are you to ask me anything? I'm you're taking pictures of our cars. Oh yeah, the public's cars, not your cars. They're it's the public. The, it, it's the county's cars. The county, and yeah. what is the county? That's public, right? Uh yes, yes it is okay. a public agency. Yeah. Yeah. So it's not your cars, it's not our cars, it's it's everybody's cars, the public's cars, right? Okay, excuse me. So a big time Karen reaction. She just took off and looped around up there. Let's go see. It's not unfortunate, it's fortunately. Yeah. Okay. So, I guess, thank you for, for um, paying attention. Sure. Good vigilance. Now learn the laws. We learned that somebody got assaulted here last week because... Because someone was recording? They recorded them assaulting someone? No, When's the last time you ever heard of someone recording going I'm out and assaulting people? people? We are concerned because concerned about somebody what? got assaulted last week. Oh, okay. Ago. Good job, Karen. Make up excuses. <laughs> Wait, can you stop for a second? I, want to, I need a good thumb down. Hold on, hold on. I need a good thumb down. No, you don't.
What is that? Old Bed's food in there? Jeez. See, we got the security up here watching still. Doing his job. Security guard. They cut him outside with the jacket. He runs inside. And I moved down a little just so he had to uh, come outside and not be so lazy. He's the one who said, unfortunately, uh, the people have rights. Well, he spits on his rights. Very sad. Hopefully he learns. There you have it, folks. Thanks for watching, and please consider signing up for a channel membership to help support the cause. Overall, the security was excellent. I spent several hours at this location throughout the different buildings, and they were always professional. The staff overall was decent. The few encounters of giving directives, misinformed employees, and passive-aggressive behavior are included in this video. Let me know what you think in the comments. This is AVA, out.